I'm James Vallis. Scientists at the U.S. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention have concluded that the Zika virus can cause microcephaly and other severe fetal brain defects, ending months of uncertainty about the link between brain defects and the virus. The results of a CDC study published in the New England Journal of Medicine on Wednesday used evidence from a number of recently published studies. It noted that it had no single piece of evidence to provide conclusive proof of a link. The CDC's conclusion means that women who are infected with Zika during pregnancy have an increased risk of having a baby with brain defects though it is still unclear how great that risk is, as a number of infected women have delivered babies that appear to be healthy with no signs of brain defects. The Zika virus was first isolated from a monkey in the Zika forest of Uganda in 1947, and the virus continued to affect mainly monkeys for nearly five more decades, causing only a mild illness when found in humans. Local transmission of Zika has been reported in 62 countries and territories across all continents, except Antarctica, according to the World Health Organization, which says further geographical spread is to be expected. Zika is spread mainly through mosquitoes, but it can be spread through sexual contact. For the very latest, stay with BNONews.com and follow us on Twitter all day for breaking news updates at BNO News. 